goddess archetypes push our edge. And what they call us to do is recognize that even though we have this identity on the surface and these certain parts of our personality that use more than others, you know, some of us are naturally the muse archetype. We're creative, we're spontaneous, we have a light sense of humor. Some of us are more the initiator archetype where we are a little more serious and confrontational and willing to push the edge of others and ourselves. Some of us, <laughs> some of us are the lady of communion, which is my most uh, present, which is just very empathic feeling into other people. Sorry, the lady of compassion, feeling into other people, recognizing other people's choices and why they do that, being able to communicate and meet them on that level. So at my personality can adjust depending on who I'm with. I can be with the muse to kind of go into that part of myself and be compassionate for their view on life and the way that they are. And I can be with an initiator and find that part in myself. So what the goddess work is, what, the reason it's cool is you can explore your uh, original, your like embodied archetype that's just natural and a part of who you are. But then you can look at the other archetypes that you feel like, that's not me. I can't go there. I don't resonate with that at all. That triggers me. And then you can actually look for the ways that that archetype does exist in you and where it can be useful to try on that energy in your life. Um, you know, for example, if you're, if I am triggered by you as the initiator, Nadia, or I feel uncomfortable in the presence of that, and it's something that I don't bring out naturally, I can really, one thing that's great is I can hang out with you actually and have a human you know, example of where, what this archetype looks like in our humanness, or I can really also study the energies of the archetypes. There's elements of each goddess. There are smells and scents and colors and um, herbs and animal totems that go with the same energy of this archetype. So this is the way that we start to look for that. And then we can actually find physical women that, you know, represent this archetype in our, in our world, whether it's mentors or friends or celebrities.